Hello, wild people. Oh, I was rudely interrupted by a camel. Well, that never happens. <laughs> Episode 20 of Building a Zoo from Scratch in Franchise Mode. This is just the most stressful thing. <laughs> We're only on episode 20. I feel like we've like not even touched the park. Look how much map there is. Oh my goodness. Okay, so today, I don't have a plan. I don't know. We're going to see what we can afford. I don't think we're going to be able to afford much. Hopefully we'll be able to sell some animals. Hopefully. And then my great plan is to try and sort this education board thing out. I mean, that would be great. Let's send you to the trade center. Do I want to move it to the trade? Why? Actually, let's go to the trade center. Hold the phone. Da -da 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 -da. Um, how do I do this? I'm on market. Where's my trade center? Am I being really? St I'm being so stupid today. To be fair, I have just woken up. I am not. I say I'm not a morning person, but I, I definitely prefer doing content in the morning, even though I'm not very awake. <laughs> oh, let's put these guys in for some research. Why have I not done this? Okay. Um. I'm, fan I'm faffing around now. Guest education raising. Oh, no. Education re research complete. Oh, vets doing advanced research. Oh, right. Is that what we need, is it? Guests have learnt the most about African wild dog. Oh. So we need more conservation boards? Education boards. Education speakers. Audio guides. Talks. Ooh. Um, okay. Oh, no. We might need to go through every single enclosure and sort it out. Oh, it's gonna be so boring. I might do that in my own time and not record it because I don't know whether you guys want to see that really. <laughs> uh, let's take these two African wild dogs and I don't want a quick trade. I don't really know what I'm doing. Let's. Where's the trade center? Where is the trade center? Oh, animal storage. Can I like? I don't understand how I sell them normally. Oh. I'm so confused. Could I? Oh, look at that little timber wolf. It's so cute. Why is that in the trade center? Who knows? There's lots of babies in here. Maybe I'm saving them. I don't know. I don't know quite what I'm doing. Um, Can I, like, release to the wild? I don't know. Some of these peacocks aren't very well, though. They've got, like, a cold or something. I'll get rid of the piggy. Can I release to the wild? I don't know, because apparently you can, like... I don't know. Make more money from them somehow, but I can't remember how you do that. I'm probably being really thick. I don't know. I'm going to make... Hopefully that'll just come back to me in a flood of, like, <laughs> hope. Right. I feel like this is an amazing space for a new animal. I do need to sort the education rating out. I know. I know I do. But, you know, <laughs> can't be bothered. No, I should really... It's a bit naughty. So what animal are we going to have today? I don't know. You guys have asked for tigers and stuff. Not that you guys are demanding at all. Crikey. How much are tigers these days? <laughs> I'm a little bit low on my conservation credits at the moment. Um, so... Oh. So hopefully uh, we'll be able to afford them, maybe? I don't know. Are we going all the way up here? Let's go all the way up here. And across. Across. Oh, poo. Come on, little guy. Stretch. There we go. I'm just going to make, like, a whack-off enclosure here. Just as a, like, basic enclosure. Well, that was lucky. It kind of fitted perfectly there. I don't know what animal we're going to have yet. It's a surprise. To so make sure you watch the whole video to find out who's going to be in our zoo. Because I'd like to know. <laughs> I'd like to know, too. Okay. If it's a... I'd love it to be like a non-African animal. <laughs> That's very good English, Chloe. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm hoping... Oh my goodness, what is going on here? Okay, e. Let's just kind of like hopefully round this off. Um, Let's get some paths a second. Let's align to grid. So what I'd like to do is maybe... Uh, do we have room? There's a staff facility there already. Okay, that's good. Oh, the wolves are so cute. Yeah, we'll do that because then we've got like a space for people to congregate. Let's congregate the word. <laughs> congregate. Do, 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 do. Don't know why that's stuck in my head. I've been singing it for like three days. I don't even know what it is. Should I put it there? I'm kind of I'm always a bit dubious about linking fencing. 
Sorry guys, it's a little bit messy this day. And there's trees in the way. Oh, African wild lion. African wild lion? <laughs> African lion has aged up. Okay. Okay, we can handle this. <laughs> we can't handle this. Ah, okay, we'll just do it to this one. That's going to really annoy me that that's not lining up. Oh, that's going to annoy me. No! No! Okay, go there, you donut. Right, there we go. Okay, straight across and then straight across again. I do not know what animal is going to be in here. It's all part of the fun because we don't know. Let's move these trees. They are annoying me for some reason. Bye bye, trees. So, yeah, there's a little place there for people to view the animal, which will be good. Do, 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 do. Um, okay, let's put the two way glass in. And the other way, so people can actually see <laughs> into the enclosure. So, that's super helpful. Cool, and then we can put some glass along here as well. And bish bash bosh, next thing you know, you've done it. Okay, so I'm not sure what I need to do now. I think I need to filter through all my animals and just see what on earth's going on. My goodness, the camels are breeding. It's too well, too well. This is great. Oh, we have a baby cheetah! Guys, when did this happen? When did this happen? Oh, it's so cute. You're a baby, you look massive. Oh. All right, sorry guys, it's like in the dark. Wait, where's my light switch? Ah, oh, look at it! That's so cute. Crikey, my animals are breeding well. Okay, let's go check and filter through. Oh my goodness. Is there a donation box there? <laughs> Please be a donation box there. Wow, look at this. Are these guys all educated? I don't even know. So much to do in a zoo, it's stressing me. Oh, there's a bit of red going on there. That's not good. Let's just... Oh, I don't want to edit Barry, I want to edit that thing. There we go. Mm, boop. Oh, 10. 10 would be good. Yes, good, that's better. Oh dear, it's a bit squishy. No, dangerous animal has not escaped. It's just a little guy, probably. Yeah. You haven't escaped, everybody. <laughs> He's like, I'm just chilling. Oh. I swear I did more to this round here, but hey ho. <laughs> this Savannah bit, I kind of hoped would be so much better, <laughs> but, but oh well. It just looks a bit scruffy, but it doesn't matter. Okay, let's sort these animals out. I keep getting distracted. Right. Diseased animal. Of course there's a diseased animal. Um, let's go to sort this out. I need to go... Where? Right. Okay. To the peacocks. There's so many of these. They are so disgusting. They're so grubby. Oh, we've had more babies. Oh, this is so hard. <laughs> this gets really stressful. This gets so stressful. Okay, you can go... Can I release to the wild? I'd like to, <laughs> please. Um, yeah, because I need some mono. Yeah, and you and you. Okay, I'm just gonna release everything to the wild. I know that you can like send to the. I don't know why you sent to the trade center. I don't know how I sold them before. I think I'm having a bit of a brain fart over that. I don't really know. <laughs> what am I doing? But that one's not diseased. That's good. Let's get all the ones that aren't diseased free and into the wild. I actually really like the, the idea of releasing them into the wild more than anything else. Okay, before anything else happens, let's just release these guys to the wild. Oh, is it thinking about it? Is it thinking about it? Oh, interesting. Oh, oh, okay. Right, how much, what? Okay, that's weird. <laughs> I think that was a bit of a weird glitch. So have I just sold my animals without a, oh no, they're still here. Right, let's release you to the wild, see what happens. Okay, that's that's worked. <laughs> I may have to do it one by one. In early the elephant packed a trunk and said goodbye to the circus. Trump, 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 Trump. Let's release these guys to the wild. Oh, you said about release. Hang on. One of you guys said don't release while you've got the contraceptive on because apparently it counts as not infer not fertile. I'm like, oh my goodness, you're a genius. Let's sell Elkhorn. Let's sell these three to the wild. Oh, that didn't make a difference. Oh, okay. Well, that's that then. Um, okay. I need to get my conservation thingies up, guys, because I need some mono to buy the next load of animals, hopefully. Sell some spiders. This is just so stressful. I have so many animals. I'm not complaining. I mean, it's good that they were breeding and stuff, but crocky. Should we put, put these guys into the wild? I know you can get more money somehow, and I've forgotten how you do it. I'm losing my mind. I'm losing my mind. 
Okay. Oh, look at these that are like... Crikey. Okay, let's sell you. Well, not sell you, but release you to the wild. You to the wild. You to the wild. The ones that are diseased, we can't. Gosh, these are all the babies that have aged up. Let's release all these to the wild a second. Ooh, 90. At least they, at least we sell those in bulk. <laughs> so they're like bulk buying. <laughs> so that's good, because you actually do get quite a lot of money. Really, I, I mean, it adds up uh, with these guys. Gosh, there's so many. And they breed so quick. Why did I not start with these? Okay, note to future self. We do a franchise mode again. Peacocks. Just go for peacocks. <laughs> okay, gradually getting through all my animals. I'm going to like release as many as I can to the wild. Trade for 21. Oh, all right, trade's there. Oh, this is how I did it. For goodness sake. Can you not do it multiple? Like for this, for example. Oh, let's release it to the wild. I'm happy with that. I don't know. <laughs> you guys know more than I do. I literally wing stuff. I'm just like, yeah, la la la. Let's put that on. There's another baby ostrich. Uh, there's quite a few. That's good. Okay. The animals are going to start getting old, I swear, soon. But I don't know. My goodness. It just looks like we're doing... We're doing all right. We're doing all right. What about this one? They're all... Is there any adults like you? Can you release to the wild? We can make more money through the trade center. Right. Okay. I think I've figured that out now. I think. <laughs> I think. I'm not overly worried because, I, as I said before, I like the idea that I've released them to the wild. I know it's just a game, but I, I just enjoy that. Okay. Let's sell. Let's sell all of these. We can always get some more frogs if they age. It doesn't matter. Let's quick trade these froggies. Froggy frog, frog, frog. Froggy frog, frog, frog. <laughs> Why I'm saying that, I don't know. But guys, I was wondering if you'd be able to help me out with the channel a little bit. Would you be able to share it to your friends if you think they'd like it? Oh, what's happened to all my zebra? I wonder if they're related. Hmm. I don't know. Uh, well, let's release this one to the wild. And then what we'll do, I need to go and collect some stuff that we've done. Yay, two African wild dogs to the wild. That was good. I didn't even realize I did that. Community, what are we doing? All right, tortoises. <gasps> Tortoise, whoa, what are you doing up there? Dude, okay, I've never seen that before. I wish I could take a screenshot, but my game won't let me. King of the castle or what? I'm so confused. I kind of want to take a screenshot, but my game won't let me screenshot at the moment for some reason. I've never seen a giraffe up there. What's happened? Is that, um, is he gonna be able to get down from there? Let's, can you, can you get down? Oh no, is it you? He's been stuck on a rock and now I have protesters. Well done. <laughs> I'm so annoyed. For goodness sake. Why is my life so dramatic? Right, let's send you to zoo. Let's hopefully not get stuck on any rocks anytime soon. I mean, how does this even happen? For goodness sake. I don't even know why this guy's in here. Send him to the zoo. Why? Why, why, why? Okay. Do, 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 do. Why are all my babies in the trade center? I think I sort of discovered this last time. Oh, I'll just quickly this. All right, center zoo. All my babies need to go back in the enclosure. I do not know what's going on there. Because <gasps> them bock. Like, there's a baby lion. I don't know why they're. I don't know. Let's go to the lion enclosure. Me. I do not know what's going on. Let's put the babies in back in because I don't know why they're not in there right now. Like my timber wolf. I have baby timber wolves in here. Does anybody know why I've had a crazy like idea to sort of put them not in their enclosure? Does anybody know why I would have done this? Am I insane? Probably. I love my wolf enclosure. I'm really proud of it. It's like one of those things I'm generally proud of. <laughs> oh dear. I really want to do like building fancy pants enclosures. Even though I'm not Oh, what's going on here? One, two, three. Send to zoo. Okay, so we have some baby ones in there. Okay. We only have one board there, but... I want to pop his balloon. Beep. Oh, they used to react in the zoo, zoo tycoon bit. Oh. Has everybody got enough food? Is everybody happy? I feel like we're okay at the moment. Apart from these diseased birds. Okay, vet research is complete. We still want to get a new animal today. 
for goodness sake okay gazembok um we do need african wild buffalo thing i keep calling everything wild why i could get some more vets uh to do some more research um cool i don't know if we need like more education boards i don't know oh my goodness look at this talk going on people are loving it that seating is full look how happy they are for the hyena that's so cool gazembok it's actually a gembok in it i don't know in it oh look how much rubbish is here oh guys come on you scruff people scruffy people this really annoys me why why is there so much rubbish here okay bins galore here we go most annoying part of the job put some benches in keep these people happy saltwater crocodile is expecting offspring woohoo that's good right so i'm gonna put a donation box right there okay okay they've chucked one in there that's good yeah i kind of need to go around and just sort this whole education board thing out oh dear but i'm not sure how to do that okay i have a thousand conservation credits does that mean i'm gonna be able to buy something pretty cool i hope so is there anything here that needs like releasing to the wild i don't know we need to keep on top of our piggies and stuff is that the only wait what's happened to my common warthogs I wait what i only have three boy common warthogs okay so what we needed okay i'm i'm <sighs> i can't handle this okay i'm gonna buy some more or higher because you can't buy people chloe that's not a thing um gonna employ from caretakers because clearly they are struggling okay we've got three new caretakers which means we probably need a new staff zone at some point and we have one here but probably need like another one now ah, we'll get there right i'm just gonna quickly go and top up my savannah because <laughs> we don't have we don't have any warthogs which really upsets me i love warthogs i need to i don't care about the disease animal i do care but i don't care right now um there's warthogs we need female warthogs um warthogs a zebra that kind of thing i don't know where is a white hog there it is come warthog i think maybe this is the only what you're the only female warthog right now uh we'll wait we'll wait i'm not gonna uh i'm not gonna spend that money no way zebra where's a zebra there it is where's be a zebra oh we got some females quick buy them all i'm gonna buy as many females as i can then hopefully we'll be able to find a male but we'll see okay that'll probably do that's a lot of zebras one two three four send to zoo at least we have zebras now that's good oh why is it so many diseased animals i'm gonna hire another vet actually as well the zoo's getting quite big now <laughs> it's getting quite big okay i've got two new vets uh let's put in another keeper let's put in two new keepers and let's put in another couple of mechanics. Um, yeah, another security. Um, I don't need vendors. Should we put another educator in? I don't even know if we need an educator, but we'll put one in. I don't know what those audio guides. We need maybe some. Oh no 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 no! You naughty! Why you do this to me? Right, somebody's being naughty here. I don't know who I bred. Oh, it's probably you. Right, you can go off to the wild. Bye bye. Oh, did I save that in time? African wild dog is preventing others from breeding. Yay! <laughs> That's annoying when that happens. Very annoying. Okay, how are we doing on the whole animal front? I don't really know. Gosh, these guys breed so quick, these African buffaloes. Crikey. Okay, African wild dogs. We don't have very many of those. Who was preventing who from breeding? Rufio. <laughs> Rufio! So I'll tell you what we're going to do with Rufio. We're gonna send you to the trades. Can I, can I release you? Probably not. I don't know. We'll send you to the trade center because clearly you're not wanting any babies. Um, I think it's where they get a bit older and they don't breed. <gasps> we're nearly four star. Are we nearly four star? We're so close. I feel like we were getting so close to four star. Come on. Oh dear. Just need to sort this education board thing out. I don't, I don't know what I'm doing. I suck at it. 
Can I send you off to the wild? I don't think I can. That's annoying. Rufio, you're going to have to rehome, mate. Sorry, buddy. And then hopefully let's go see if we can find some African wild dogs. Why is this so stressful today? <laughs> Guys, I just wanted to add in a new animal. We still might do that today. Maybe. Oh, these aren't the best, but let's just buy one. We have to be all right with it. I think this is all we have. This is all we have. Let's go find the African wild dog enclosure. Um, is this them? Hello? Yes, it is. I like having a huge pack of them. Like, I enjoy watching them. Is that sad? Probably. Well, let's go say hello to a famous person so we get some conservation credits. Um, Indian peafowl. I don't know what they're doing. Okay. Oh, okay. I'm stressed. This is a stressful time. Let's see, what's, uh, see what animals we can potentially afford. Or potentially not afford. Any species. Now, this is a big enclosure here. I don't know how much space we have. Oh. Uh, we do need to put in a... Stuff, stuff door. Uh, hello. Okay, I'll do. Um, let's see how much space we have. How much space do we have? Two thousand and eight. C eight eight eight. Okay, let's. I mean, I'd love a hippo, but I kind of wanted something different from. Let's have a look at the list here. I mean, I kind of wanted something different from African animals. Um, but we'll see. Like, can we afford monkeys yet? Oh no, this gets stressful. So we need more facilities for, oh, okay. We need another vet practice place. Okay, let's put one of those in. Where? I don't know. Oh, have I got any other staff facility things? Well, let's put another staff center in the back of here. Sorry guys, it's so, it gets really scatty the game. Well, I get really scatty on the game. <laughs> let's just put it that way. Uh, where should I put it? Going off this way? Yeah, that'll do it. We'll just have like a little staff section down here. And hope that that kind of works. Okay, that'll do for now. Uh, let's go facilities. And then, what do we need? Um, staff facilities. We need a vet practice. That's what we need. Oh, that was lucky. It fit. Let's put another, like, workshop in there. Let's put... I uh, don't really need quarantine or anything. Let's put a little research centre in there. Staff room. Let's put a couple of staff rooms in. And a keeper's hut. Which, let's put a bit closer to everything. Yeah, okay, that'll do for now. That'll do for now. Crikey, we have so many people in the zoo. This is insane. Luckily, this this is smiling. We need more drink places, according to our, our doodah. So let's put some drink stuff in here. Let's do that. I don't know if we're going to get around to putting animals in today. I wanted to. Okay, let's have like, ah, uh, if we go path, let's go align grid. Oh, not with that one. Not with that one. Oh, Ashpath. Ashpath. I don't even know how to say that. Okay, cool. So people have got a bit more <laughs> room. <gasps> this is so stressful when people are just... Okay, let's deselect grid and just kind of bodge job that on the end there. Yep, it looks terrible. I know, but it'll do. It'll do, donkey. That'll do. Um, Guest facilities, we need some drink stands. People are moaning at me because they need some drinks. Let's put soda in. Let's put another information center in, actually, because apparently this is where people get their... Oh, facilities without power. That'll be all this stuff I'm putting in. Okay, that's fine. We can sort that out. Put Bernie's bakes in. Uh, merchandise. We need to do some research for merchandise. We have, like, no merchandise. <laughs> okay, that's a lot there. Luckily, we have a... St there's no where is no fa wait what what facilities without power oh there oh okay that's fine let's just put in a transformers there cool okay that'll do it vet research is complete wonderful and then mechanic research is that done yay we've done quite a lot there that's good crikey look we have so many things now this is great how do you do gold research on animals? Let's have a look at the vet research. So I have more vets now, which is good. Oh no, there's an active disease and I haven't even known. Oh man, okay. Let's just, I mean, it's getting dark again. That happened quick. Let's see what animals we get, guys. I'm so like, 
scatty. I'm trying to like organize everything. It's so hard. <laughs> okay, what species do we want? I mean, I'd love a bongo. And we could go the whole rainforest route, but um, hippo, patamas. They need so much room. Oh, there is none. Well, that's good. Uh, so potentially a hippo. What about a black bear or a... I love tortoises. <laughs> the tortoise doesn't need that much space, but meh. Let's, let's, let's tickle the bears. <gasps> what about an elephant? Hold the phone. That would actually fit. Can I afford... I mean, even the Indian elephant or Indian rhino. I think I'm being a bit uh, hopeful <laughs> to get that. What about a tiger, a leopard? What other things have we got that we could put in? Okay, I've highlighted most of them. Red ruffed lima. Uh, they don't need that much room, but they're pretty good at like drawing the crowds in. Uh, I kind of want to save them though, but... Mandrills are so horrible. They, I just, well, they're not, but they remind me of the, in Tarzan, when Tarzan gets chased down. That was my childhood, you see. Oh, let's have a look at Tiger. Let's see if I can afford any of this. The other thing I could do as well is make like a, an American Plains thing, which would be, what would that be? That would be American Bison, <laughs> American Bison, and his little mate, which is a pronghorn doodah. Pronghorn antelope. I mean, we could always do an American themed. Oh, maybe it's telling me something there. Okay, let's go for an American themed thing. We need a male one of those. I actually don't know how many of these we can fit in a enclosure. Oh, right. They can have loads. They can have like 10 females. That's fine. I'm happy with that. Yeah, okay. We're going to have an American thing then. Let's just buy as many things as we can sort of see here. Yes. There aren't, um, I've just ticked the two that I want, <laughs> what a donut. There aren't many, um, are there, are there wild buffalo in, in America now? Because I, I wish I kind of could go back in, in time and see, and see the, the, the buffalo, do you know what I mean? Oh my gosh, I could totally afford this tiger. I could afford both tigers. <gasps> um, dee 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 dee. We'll, we'll save that for next time. I think next episode we're definitely going to get some tigers involved. So if you want to check that out, guys, and don't want to lose our channel, subscribe. Subscribe. Okay, let's just put all of these... Oh, I wish it wasn't dark. I feel like things are going to be getting complicated soon. <laughs> what do you mean, soon? It's already complicated. Okay, cheetah, saltwater crocodile, yes, oh okay. Um, Let's go to animal trading. Let's put our... Oh my goodness. Why are all the babies back in? I don't understand. Okay. Okay, let's just... Oh my gosh, everyone's maturing. Okay, the two African wild lions. I keep calling them African wild lions. Everybody's aging up and I don't know what to do. Help. I don't know what to do. Okay, let's pause. Let's just put all these in quick before anything else happens. Is that... Is that, is that what I bought? I thought I bought more females than that. I don't know. Send to zoo, and we're going to make them a big African plain bit here, which will be great fun, and they're going to love it. Okay, animals market. Hopefully, if a male bison pops up, we're going to get them, but they do seem to be quite hard to... Whoop, I'm going to buy that one. They do seem to be quite hard to buy sometimes. Trade center, and there should be another one. Yep. Yeah. Send you to zoo too. Okay, we're going to sort these guys out in a minute. Ooh, breed exhibit species. Oh, that'll happen. That will definitely happen. We're so close to four stars. It's just like hanging in there. I'm like, come on. Maybe I could just go around and put a load of those conservation boards in. Wherever they are. Let's just put some of this in for now. Craw, okay. Where are all the people? I don't know. We're gonna need some bins and stuff because it's so boring, but we're gonna need to. Let's put one there, one there, and one there. Let's just move this over slightly, actually. Move. Boop. And, yeah, we're gonna need a <laughs> West African lion. We need to check our lines out and make sure that they're not imbre gonna inbreed, actually. That's probably a good idea. Oh my gosh, do we have so many animals? This is insane. So, and there's babies. Let's just kind of sort this out. Okay, we need to sell these like you, you can go to the wild. Off you, pop. Oh, this is so 
complicated and stressful. Do you know, Planet Zoo, I can only play for a certain amount of time because my little brain is like overwhelmed. Yeah, let's have an animal talking point there, just randomly. Let's do that. Doesn't really, and we can put some seats. Where are we gonna put seats? Here. People have to walk around the seats, but nah. Just have like one set of seats there. Sorted. Um, yeah, I don't know what I'm doing now. I am waiting for my little guys to arrive and hopefully it won't be dark much longer because that is really annoying when this happens. I think I have my torch on as well. Yes, I do. Come on, I need four stars and then, has it gone up to four stars? I have achieved something. Yay, fame reward. Great. Okay, we need to go to the lions, Chloe. That's what we need to do. Okay, they're here. Let's just check. Oh, crikey. Okay. Let's just check all the animals a second. So, uh, okay, we have two males. That might not be a good thing. That's not a good thing. Yep, I was just about to sort that out, actually. Come on, scroll quicker. Oh, my goodness. Come on, I'm scrolling for the light. Gosh, we have three males. When did this happen? Okay, you and you definitely send you to the trade center because hopefully we'll be able to... So, then you go to the trade center, right? Where's it? What? Your stored animals. I've just asked you to go to the trade center. Okay. Then what we do is we trade. <gasps> you get double the amount of money? No. <gasps> okay. I should have listened from the start. I should have listened, but I didn't. Oh my goodness. Okay. And then let's just hope. Oh my goodness. This is painful. The scrolling is pit. Did I mean to do that? I don't know. Okay, let's just have a look here. So you guys, I don't know if these are related to the the male we have in there now. So let's have a look at Obligablablab. I don't know her name. Uh, who's your dad, mate? Who is your dad? Oh, it is Atawatawana. Atawatawana. Uh, what about Camu? What's your dad? Atawana as well. So we don't want him inbreeding. That'll be great. What about you? I love how clever this game is. So clever. And everybody else, I think, is fine. Kasha, I don't know. I bred this one, but I don't think her dad is Atawana. Oh, yes it is. So let's send this one to the trade center too. We do not want inbreeding, unless I get a new male in there. I mean, I could, I could do that. Rather than, because we've got quite a lot of females. Well, we've got males as well. Like this one here, who's your dad? Parents, unknown father, okay. And what about you? Unknown father, okay, so they're okay. It's just the one, I think. Oh, this is just stressful. Oh, you as well. Yeah, actually what we'll do is we'll just get a new mail in. Let's do that. Let's send you to the trade center. Let's put in, let's go back to my animal trading. Let's get the female lion back let's just sort that out gosh this is so crazy oh this is so crazy uh let's send back to the zoo i'm gonna get a new fresh male that's what i'm gonna do if i can afford one <laughs> it's a big if is there any male bison no i will adopt you though because i love pressing the adopt button <laughs> let's go to african african lion Apparently there's no tigers or snow leopards yet, guys, but we can still be hopeful. Who's died now? Oh, no. Oh, okay. We don't have that many. Uh-oh. I don't have a male now. But I just bought another female. <laughs> there goes our last female. Um, hopefully a male will pop up soon. We'll see. Okay. Um, I don't know what to do from here. We need to sort this enclosure out here. Oh, here they come. It's taken ages for them to, to get here, but they are here. Okay, we have these boards. Oh, this is super, super stressful. It's gonna be quite a long episode, I think, guys. <laughs> Woo! Oh, he just used our bin. That's nice. Uh, okay, let's okay, let's sort them out first. So let's see if they're happy. So this is gonna be an American. Oh, he doesn't like that. Of course, he doesn't like that because he's not from Africa. I'm not from Africa. What do you want? Let's put all this in and we need terrain, which is actually quite happy with. That's not bad. Okay, let's put in bits and bobs of stuff because, oh, 
that went a bit extreme. Well, yeah, just dotting different things uh, around different like colors of stuff make it, just make it look quite nice, you know. Um, so let's put a bit more. I mean, it likes grass and sand and stuff. Too much sand, maybe. Let's put some soil at the front here. Yeah, I think that. Okay, that's fine. That was really easy. <laughs> that was like the easiest thing. Okay, let's put some rocks in. You guys know how much I love rocks. This is a Savannah rock. We want the Tiaga rock. So it looks a bit different. We can create like a kind of privacy wall out of the rocks. I don't know if that works, to be honest. It used to work for Zoo Tycoon. <laughs> you guys remember that? Oh, the best game ever. So I want it to kind of look like a Grand Canyon. That's what I'm doing here. I'm using the rock formats to kind of well the rock the way the rocks work is just brilliant it's rocking uh, so the game will sort of like sort itself out if you just kind of smudge them around a bit it's really cool I'm so happy with this game it's genius I love it okay um okay we have some racks I've gone a bit crazy with the rocks here <laughs> I love them okay let's just get a little tiny bit of water Because animals are attracted to water. So hopefully then they'll come to the front here. And then people will be able to view them. That will be good. It's a bit sort of squishy around there. But it'll do. And um, let's put another water thing in. Like. Yeah. Like that. I don't know. It's like the African plains. Even though we're definitely not African animals. They are. <laughs> they are definitely American. Ah. Who's from America here? Let me know in the comment section below. I'd love, I'd literally love to know if you're from America. And how are you doing? Do you like living in America? I, there's a part of me that would love to move to America. But you guys, some of you say it's really hard to live in America. It's like not the dream everyone says it is or something. I don't know. Correct me, correct me if I'm wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong. Okay, we'll just put like a little one. Yay, that's quite cute. Okay, let's put some forage in. Wow, look at this tree. Are they going to like that? Oh, no, they don't like that. Then why does it tell me that they like it? Okay, let's get rid of Africa. I don't know. North America. Okay, I don't know what trees they're going to like here. I think they like this kind of thing. Oh, no, they do like that. It must have had a different tree in there. What? <laughs> put a Christmas tree in. Yes. <laughs> Sounds brilliant. Okay, let's put in. I love these big trees. I think. Oh, wow, look at this Christmas tree. That's cool. Let's put little tiny flowers in because it looks so nice. Definitely my favorite part of the, the job here. <laughs> Definitely. Best part of Planet Zoo at, oh, poop, is putting the trees in. Put in the trees and stuff in. So fun. Put some bushes in. Oh, what's going on with that? What is going on with this? Got some bushes. Oh, I literally love doing this. So fun. What's your favorite animal on the zoo then, guys? And what do you want to see hopefully added next time? I'm hoping we can put in a tiger because I'm pretty sure I can afford it. I'm pretty sure I can afford it. So yeah, if we can, we might do that. It's a hawthorn bush. Uh, where am I going to put this? Where should I put this? I could put it like uh, across. Yeah, like across the water like that. That'll, that'll do. And then we could put in some more bushes here. Like we could just put in a little hawthorn bush thing there. Like some lady fern. And some nettles. <laughs> it literally makes me so happy. Let's put some more bushes in. It's so pretty. And I like the fact, you know, there's loads of different colours. Like the tree, you know, the plants, the flowers. I mean, I haven't even done half the scrolling yet. I should really. Oh, that's a little skinny guy. <laughs> little skinny one. He's so cute. So yeah, I love the willow trees as well. White sage, let's put some sage in there. And then let's put some of these in. I kind of like to put the trees in clusters because that way I feel like they don't take up too much room. You know? Cool. Yeah, I'm happy with that. And I think they're happy with that. Let's put in a bluebell thing just there. Yeah, I'm really happy with that. Yay. Okay, let's press play. We need to add some things for our actual animals now, which would be good. So let's go species. Let's go... American bison and the pronghorn. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. Okay. Does anybody else have to sing the song to like remember your alphabet? I do. Let's put that in there. 
Oh no. People are fighting. It's the sable antelope again. Okay, it's so stressful. Where's the sable antelope? It's gonna be a pain. Oh no, you've still diseased. They haven't sorted that out yet. Oh. Right, you need to go on there. I hope there's no inbreeding happening. Okay, oh my gosh, the frogs. The frogs. The frogs are crazy. Let's quickly sell them. Oh my goodness. So many frogs. Okay, let's... I don't know what I was doing. I was going to stop a prong something attacking each other. <laughs> Where is it? Sable antelope. Is that you? No, you're a female. You're okay. Oh, you died. That's really sad. Uh, you need to go on this and... Where's the other male one then? You. You escaped my view. Okay. Let's just release him. So much quicker. <laughs> just like, bye bye. Okay, he'll do for now. Okay, we still need to sort this American place out for these animals. Okay, I'm going to put a toy like right there. So hopefully it will draw them towards our boards. That's my I idea. That's my great idea. Yeah, let's put in a shelter like this. And I'm just going to do this. I just think it looks quite nice like that. You know, without the big concrete thing. Yeah, I like that. Cool. Uh, let's put in a large football. I think the football looks a bit cheesy, but it's fine. They like it. Yeah, let's put in a mud bath. Where are we going to put that? I can't fit that around there. Okay, let's put in a big mud bath. Let's put in a scratching post like there. And then let's have a scratching tree or two. Let's put in a small barrel grazer. Let's put in a couple of those, actually. That's good. And then a little bit of water. We do have water. I need to check that that's going to be clean, actually. Oh, that was lucky. That was good. Yay, covered. Okay, let's sort out a bit of the information here. Oh, I need to get rid of that. Where is the bards? But guys, if you're enjoying this video and you want to see more of it, please smash that like button or just let me know in the comment section below what you'd like to see more of, how you think I can improve the channel, that kind of thing. It's just very chill at the moment. Very chill. Very, very chill. Let's put a pronghorn in there. And let's put another bison in there. Cool, same with the speaker. Let's put this on. Cool, and then let's let's. Where's my speaker for this? Oh, there it is. Pronghorn antelope. Pronghorn antelope. I'm gonna just move this one along slightly so it kind of covers a little bit more. Cool. Ah, uh, and then we've just got this one, haven't we? Let's put this one up. And then this one here. And then we'll put that in there. Hopefully, this will cover a bit more of our... Oh, it's so painful. Is that good? Yeah, okay, that'll do. Yeah, okay, people are starting to get drawn this way. That's good. Let's check this section out as well. Oh, super stressful. But once we've sorted this, I think we've pretty much done it. Put that there. And... Well, we've sort of done today's episode once I've completed this, but we're going to just finish off, try and get some education rating in here, because <laughs> obviously I suck at that. Oh, what are we doing next episode then, guys? Am I going to buy those tigers? I think I should. Everybody needs tigers in their life. Then we can have maybe an Indian section. That would be really cool, actually. Where are the boards? Here they are. Okay, there's a board there, and let's put a board, like, right bang in the middle. And then we can get a... Sp Education speaker? I don't know where they are. Cool. Let's put pronghorn. Cool. I think we're pretty much... We're pretty much there, aren't we? Oh, that's not a good idea. Let's just make that a little bit small. Maybe I should move this over a bit. Yeah. We'll do that, and then we can up it a smidge. And uh, then this one we can probably move over there a little bit, actually. And then we'll up that one a smidge. Are they touching? They are touching! Okay, yeah! Okay! I'll just move this slightly so it's actually in a... In with the board sort of thing. Ah, oh, no! More Sable Antelope fighting! Oh, man. Okay, let's just... Okay, Sable Antelope! You are nothing but drama queens. Come on, come on, and my 
we've got another baby giraffe. That's awesome. Okay, you. You can go to the wild if we can. Yes. Sweet. Okay, guys, that's it for episode 20. Oh my gosh. I feel like that was the longest episode ever, but we needed to sort so much out. At least we have a whole American Plains thing here. Yay! How fun was that? Okay, guys, if you've enjoyed that and you want to see some tigers in the next episode, let me know in the comment section below. Let me know. If you could smash that like button for me as well, that would be really, really appreciated. Okay, guys, have a wild rest of your day. Thanks so much for watching. Bye!